we had over Easter is pretty much coming uh, to an end, but it doesn't mean I've got any warm sunshine on offer. In fact, this afternoon, quite the opposite from the, the bright skies we had this morning, we're going to be left with fairly overcast skies for the second half of the day. But on the satellite, you can see where we've seen the clearer skies today over parts of Lincolnshire, but now the clouds really been developing across most parts of the country, and it's turning fairly grey, and on top of that, quite damp as well. Let's have a look at the Midlands then. This is at 3 o'clock in the afternoon. Spits and spots of rain, nothing more than that. It is really just an overcast day with dribs and drabs of rain from time to time. Not very pleasant, 6 degrees Celsius across uh, the Midlands and Northern England. Now across Scotland, a little bit more sunshine here, but one or two snow flurries coming and going. It'll still be raining across Belfast during the course of the afternoon. That rain extending across the Irish Sea through the Isle of Man into Wales. The south of Wales and possibly the southwest as well looks as though we'll get away to a, a reasonable afternoon, even have some sunshine around here as well. But I wouldn't bank on it completely. Basically, the further east we go, the thicker the cloud gets and then into the London area for the second half of the day, dribs and drabs of rain as well. It looks as though East Anglia will probably hang on to the dry weather through most of the day. And then tonight, most of the country will have a blanket of cloud. There'll be some spots of rain around here and there, so really not uh, no real frost to talk about across most of England, Wales and Northern Ireland above freezing here. The, the frost will be reserved towards Scotland and the very far northeast of England. In some spots here, temperatures down to uh, around about minus five degrees Celsius, which means we wake up to a crisp and frosty start across the northeast. But for the rest of us, a lot of grey here, so lots of cloud, spots of rain as well, and even more than just a few spots of rain in the southwest and, and Wales, quite heavy at times in places like Plymouth and into Cardiff. And then eventually all of this rain you can see here will drift further and further eastwards. Now, if you're going to the, uh, the football tomorrow evening in Northern Ireland, we'll probably see a few showers around, six degrees there, and also in Scotland be prepared for one or two showers. Quite nippy temperatures are only around about four or five degrees Celsius at around about eight o'clock in the evening. Now, now, on Saturday, it's still raining to an extent across the east of the UK. Make the most of the sunshine further westwards here because by the time we get to Friday, it's all downhill. Once again, strong Atlantic winds blasting their way out of the ocean and it looks as though we're going to see some very squally, gusty showers. In fact, on most of these coasts here, up to gale force winds, hail, thunder, a very squally day. Yes, maybe 10 degrees in the sunshine, but if you catch one of these showers, it will be cold. So it looks as though we're going to...